Hi, it's Dr. Natalie and I'm filming another video for Micronutrient Mondays and today I'm going to be talking about selenium. Selenium is a trace mineral that functions primarily as an antioxidant, but it's also got a number of other functions that are very cool and maybe a little bit less known, so I'd like to talk about those as well. Selenium helps to protect us, protect us against the effects of heavy metals, so things like mercury, cadmium, and arsenic. These are things that we're ingesting in our diet or acquiring from our environment. Selenium stimulates the immune system in a few ways. Specifically, it supports natural killer cell activity. Natural killer cells are really important um, because they're like our first responders um, when we have a cell that's uh, infected with a virus or if there's tumor formation. So there's um, an anti-cancer mechanism that uh, selenium is supportive to. There was also a very recent study that showed that daily selenium supplementation significantly reduced the decline of CD4 counts in HIV patients, so further supporting the integral role that selenium plays in the immune system. Selenium is required for sperm maturation and motility, so really important to get those good strong swimmers going. Um, it's also important for fetal development, so both for men and for women. Selenium uh, is required for actual uh, thyroid hormone conversion, so into the active thyroid hormone. Um, so Im really important for a healthy thyroid. A thyroid hormone acts on nearly every cell in our body, so really important to, to support our thyroid. Having low levels of selenium has been um, connected to an increased risk of certain diseases like cancer, cardiovascular disease, and inflammatory disease. So we really want to make sure we're getting enough selenium, and how you can do that is by eating more Brazil nuts, um, having oats, brown rice, red Swiss chard, or protein sources like fish, eggs, chicken, and red meat. So I hope you learned something about selenium. Thank you so much for listening. Um, if you'd like to reach me, you can do so from my website at www.healthandthecity.com um, or you can email me at drnataliebaz at gmail.com. Thank you so much. Take care.